blue boy. Look at him. He's so precious. <laughs> there we go. Hello, everyone. Welcome to a uh, fight of animals. This is a game that came out like a month or so ago. It's a meme game. And I'm just going to show you some like really sick combos that are really easy to do. Like they're they're relatively easy. This game really relies on a thing called a it has Street Fighter 4 mechanics where you can uh, dash cancel out of most things. So that's something uh, this game relies on. So usually most combos I'm going to do in the corner are possible anywhere on screen if you dash cancel. Just a fair warning. But they're easier to do in the corner. So that's what I'm going to do. So this first one's with Slender Cat, the recent, uh, the recent addition to the fight of animals scene. So you're going to first start out with a simple, and this is like standard for most people, you're going to do light heavy, light heavy into back skill. So once again, it's light heavy into back skill. And after back skill, you're going to go into forward skill. And this is going to cause them to bounce up, okay? So light heavy, light heavy, back skill, forward skill, which, and then you're going to go heavy back skill forward skill into super and this does an easy 50 percent and just to prove it to you i'm gonna also do it mid screen so same combo but i'm going to dash cancel into it and it works still so it always goes from about 50 percent to like 53 percent it just kind of depends but it's a really nice combo really fun way to start out Okay, so this is Magic Squirrel. Magic Squirrel, I've experimented a little bit with him, but him or her. But Magic Squirrel has a couple combos. Uh, first one I'm going to show is pretty simple, pretty uh, ordinary. It's going to start out with the same thing. Light, heavy. Light, heavy, back suit skill. Uh, light, heavy, back skill into forward skill. Pick it, and then you pick it back up with... And the trick to this one is with uh, Magic Squirrel is instead of when you pick the combo back up, instead of going back skill forward skill, you want to go back skill. You want to go back skill into heavy skill. That way you have enough aerial to hit the super. And these are this is just a really standard combo, kind of like a BNB almost. Uh, I messed it up, so of course. <laughs> and then. And it's as simple as that. It gets another 500. It's about, depending on how you hit it, it's usually about 40 to 50 percent. Uh, if you get the timing right, 50 percent, 51 percent. Kind of good. Kind of no, it's kind of ordinary. Uh, there's another really hard combo. A little bit harder. It relies on hit that ability, which can cause two bounce ups. Which is something that I learned about while I was recording. And the thing is, you cannot combo into super with this. So, but without super, it does about 40%. I didn't even need to practice it. So, light, heavy. So, instead of going back, back skill, forward skill, you're going to go, you're going to do light, heavy into uh, down skill. And then you're going to pick it up, and you're going to do back skill, down skill. So I'm going to just repeat it for you again. So there you go. That's the first pickup. And then you see I can get another pick off up there, pick up off there. And this this may be a glitch, or just a really neat mechanic that Magic Squirrel has, which kind of makes them insane. But you can get a 40% combo off of this usually. If you land it right. And then after the second pickup, just. I just like to do heavy into uh, forward skill. That's just how I like to do it. So once again, I'm just going to do the whole combo if I can land it. And it's a little weird pickup for some reason. Sometimes it's a little weird. You gotta work on timings with this character. And yeah, there we go. So you see right there. Uh, it's just kind of standard, kind of a little more complex, but the thing about it is you get 40% for no super, which is pretty good for a character. 
Uh, anyways, that's Magic Squirrel. Uh, next one I'm gonna show is Power Hook Dog. Uh, if you don't real, if you don't realize, I'm picking Power Hook Dog as my fill every time. Uh, different characters have weird hitboxes. So Mighty Fox has a really weird hitbox where some moves can't connect. You just gotta work on timings with that. But Power Hook Dog is what I'm working with. So when you try these combos with different characters, make sure you try with every character to figure out what timings you need to do in order to land a combo. But with my dogs, it's not really anything too insane. Uh, uh, low heavy into heavy into forward skill, and then you have to dash cancel into another forward skill, and then you can do super. So I'm going to try it all at once, because I'm still kind of new at this. Okay, so that, bam, bam. If I land it right, it, it'll look kind of good. It's not, it's just a, it's one of the few combos I saw that I can land. And just like that, it's 40%. Uh, Power Hook Dog, kind of a standard character. There's a lot of uh, realm that I still haven't explored with them. Uh, but if you find any more, I'll try to find more combos as I play. Uh, is this about my fifth or sixth hour playing the game? So, Walking Cat. Okay, so first mechanic that I realized with this character. Uh, oh, wrong. <laughs> Uh, his back skill is a parry, so if they hit you, it's a uh, kind of a parry type move where you can counter back. Okay, maybe it's not a parry. It's a counter, okay? It's a counter. I did it again, okay. <laughs> Fart sound means start uh, Start here, okay? Future Dustin. <laughs> okay, so this is Walking Cat, another OG of the game. Uh, Note here, his uh, back skill is a uh, counter, so if they hit you during this, you uh, attack back. So for this, his basic BNB that I found out is going to be, you still start out with light heavy. You know, light heavy. And to, instead of doing back skill, forward skill, you're just going to do two forward skills. So I'm going to try that, I'm going to do that again for you. Like that. And then when you launch him in the air, you're going to go down heavy into another one of these. Forget what I just said there, okay? You're going to go down heavy into down skill and then alt. So I'm going to do it all here. If I, if I stop messing it up. If I just stop messing it up, I'll hit it. And like that, you get 42%, 420 damage. Nice. And yeah, uh, that's Walking Cat's combo. So by the way, with a Slender Cat, I didn't mention this at the beginning, but when it comes to Slender Cat, let's say you don't have your super, okay? Like I said, Slender Cat's my main, so I'm gonna... <laughs> Look at how adorable he is. Of course I'm going to keep talking about him. Let's say you don't have your super, okay? You just do his regular B&B &B and you're like, how do I end it? How do I do a good ender? You get more damage. So just do laser, which is down special or down skill. It's a good ender and it gets good Oki from my knowledge. You know, you can size if you're in the corner with him during that. So let's say you're in the corner with him and you do that. You can, uh, let me try that again. You can dash and then you end up behind them. And that can really mix some people up who aren't expecting that. So Slender Cat kind of OP, at least against Power Hook Dog. Like I said, hitboxes are kind of funky. Uh, every, so far this has worked for everyone except Mighty Fox and I think Squirrel. Squirrel is the other one that really acts weird. So yeah, just keep that in mind. But I think that's gonna end the video. Uh, I'm gonna look for more combos. This is a really fun game. Uh, Fight of Animals, uh, it's a really fun game. A lot of, if you wanna see more videos like this, I I don't mind at all because, well this is my fucking game now. <laughs> but yeah, uh, I'll see you guys next time. And keep slender. Thank you.